Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you guys how to create this really funky water marbling design. I was super inspired by a really good friend here on YouTube and her channel name is Cute Polish and she inspired me so much that I wanted to recreate this design on my channel and show you guys how to Please do it Please go check her yourself. channel out, she's a very sweet dear friend of mine and I've known her for quite a few years now. Her nail art is super simple and super beautiful and she's so talented and very creative. So go and check her channel out you guys and subscribe and now let me show you how to recreate her fun cute water marbling design. So I've started this design by painting my nails with one coat of white nail polish and I allow that to dry completely. Next I'm going to use some scotch tape and I'm going to go ahead and tape my finger for the water marbling design. Next I'm going to use some neon colors and I'm going to use a yellow, a pink, and I didn't really have a very neon looking type green so I'm going to be using this one. I'll list all the names of the nail polishes in the description box below this video. And I'm just going to place the colors randomly on top of the white nail polish. In this cup I've got just some regular tap water, it's not even filtered, it is room temperature though. For this design to work, um, you have to make sure that you use room temperature. I'm also going to be using some of this hand sanitizer, and I didn't have a spray bottle form, this is just one of those pump bottles so what I did is I put some of that hand sanitizer in one of these spray bottles. As you can see, it's just a glass little spray bottle. Um, any little spray bottle like this will work. And you need this in order to get these little bubbles onto the nail. And I'll show you guys what I mean. I'm going to go ahead and take my black nail polish and I'm going to drop about three to four drops of nail polish into the water. Now if your nail polish doesn't spread too well, that means your nail polish is old and you need to get a new bottle or your water temperature is too cold. You can always help it a little bit by shaking the little cup. Now I'm going to take my hand sanitizer spray and I'm going to hold it above my cup and I'm going to spray it in there and sort of mist it down. And depending on how much you missed, that's how many bubbles you get. And if you're happy with the design, you can go ahead and pick a little spot here anywhere on in this cup here and you can go ahead and drop your, your um, finger down. If you're not happy with the way the pattern came out, you can always just clean it up and start again with the same process until you're satisfied with the little bubbles. So I'm going to try it again. Don't forget to top coat. 